Modern history of Russia is a deep longing for the USSR, but not even the monstrous defective USSR as it actually was, mostly the desirable image of the communist empire. And the war in Ukraine is not something new for Russians, rather logic continued due to the world neutrality towards previous Russian wars. And everywhere the rhetoric was the same. Russia tried to present itself as a peacekeeper fighting against nationalists. The collapse of the Soviet Union coincided with the denationalization in Nagorno-Karabakh. It lasted for six years. South Ossetia, 1991-1992. North Ossetia and Ingushetia, 1992, once again Russian troops, terror and territory capture. Same year, one more experiment to create a puppet country, Transdniestria Moldavian Republic. At least a thousand people were killed then. 92-94, Abkhazia, first cruel intervention into Georgia and almost 3,000 people died. 92-97, Tajikistan, one more attempt to build the so-called Russian Empire in Central Asia. Chechen war in the mid-90s took the lives of 5,000 Russian occupiers and thousands of lives of civilians. Russians actually lost the first war, but they came back in 1999, and during the next 10 years they destroyed the real Chechen sovereignty, creating instead a puppet Kadyrov state. 2008. Invasion in Georgia, annexion and creation of puppet Abkhazia state. 2014. Russians invade Ukraine for the first time. Annexation of Crimea and part of the Donbass territories. 2015. Russians in Syria supporting the dictator Assad. Half million people were killed there. 2022. A war in Ukraine in front of the EU, NATO and other institutions. Russia expected the same ignorant neutral position of the world society. But looks like it's time to stop the state and recognize it as a terrorist state Russia.